All right, we want to go back to a big story that we were telling you about at the top of this newscast. A 12,000 seat amphitheater could be coming to Northeast El Paso and the city is promising a huge economic impact. Oh yeah, KFOX 14 News at 5's Harrison Parker spoke to the neighbors of this future site with more about these major plans. Hey Harrison. That's right, this whole area should be transformed if a $80 million amphitheater gets built in the next two years. It will bring four and a half billion dollars, according to the city, in economic activity. The locals I spoke to are excited, but a lot of them said it's about time. I feel like it's a, a bit overdue. We've missed out on a lot of opportunities for good shows and big events because we don't really have the space to hold it. Brittany Viescas, a local restaurant employee, said she travels multiple times a year to Albuquerque, New Mexico, because El Paso lacks the proper venues. For hotel, food, um, just to explore a little bit, you're looking at easy two to three hundred. Viescas said with this venue, she'd love to spend the money here in El Paso. Notes live in the city of El Paso estimate the revenue from the project will generate $5.4 billion for the region. Villasquez thinks that money will help Northeast El Paso and her employer's income. I mean, I think that's great for business, honestly, uh, to have something so big next to us. I feel like that's going to draw in a lot more attention, especially to the Northeast area, because it's been growing a lot. Notes Live Incorporated, the developer of the project, will be funding the endeavor entirely with private money. They built projects across the country with amphitheaters already built in similar cities. For locals like Viasquez, the benefits go beyond the performance. She's excited for a more evenly spaced entertainment scene. Because they've been adding a lot downtown, but just to have more things throughout the city is just so much better. Well, just before we went to air, I spoke with an official from the city who said this is all part of the Cohen Master Plan, a plan released a few years ago to redevelop this entire area. They say they hope this amphitheater will kick off a bunch of new development, keeping building around the water park and this amphitheater as this part of Northeast El Paso continues to grow. Reporting from Northeast El Paso, Harrison Parker, KFOX 14 News at 5.